court orders the sale of Michael Essien's two houses in Accra. Essien was in the news for all the wrong things. What was it? In the news, you heard a list of legends of Morgana. How unto me and she and can and ye aye Michael Essien a di infim because ye can ye Michael Essien aye a Morgana ha chesa wabobra a Morgana ha ono so abua amache si aji Ghana and so esi ho ye pa unto me and she Oh, can the list of legends are more Ghana? How be my case a ding a film? Then so any my case and Ababonte and I say, Nimu news Ababonte as Jam Noka say, dear court, a dear Jinamu, a machesia jay, my case on one Cassanifi, our Brissier, your Jeffin in Sam Nina, a cabia, or de a binum, and a somna cupim, or court, I'm Sam Noka say, dear court, a j a and a dime, a fin in Sam. Aha, a dear Sally Hop TV, mess out of your video, no be like am I. Na a few was answer as subscribing in ten times so we are no answer so I share video no any and I your first time so I'm aware if you saw don't sabbat hit the notification so see the video in the bit too much I know I be the first person on sabbat county I was on for see me kind of a can legends on what gonna have the my creation with me can you need him because my creation has been the person or no about blaster that now after blaster no cross and so I boy Chelsea that or some sort of AC Milan that was some sort of even Real Madrid as you see, you see, I'm not only defending champions of Champions League. Yeah, can't team Papa Papa is so much. Eh, I'm more biased for now. I'm just a Real Madrid. Eh, my case is about side team. We're going to be a bit. It's a can football legends. I just say Ghana for. Yeah, so yeah, what? Eh, my case is and so a can. Now, and eh, and I just say eh, in Kofobi, eh, my case is and eco pim eh, or court. Now, I'm looking pim or court. I'm going to say me in and say my case is and I just say no one else should know. Now, now, and I'm going to say I just say eh, no one else should and I had a cell, no so ever bob, Bussian if you were more. Now, my friend, you are Bussiano, and yard is a my creation, a bit to SK. A more true my creation, or more than a faha, and a faha, my creation, this can only be. In the way, and as a court, and so a dear genemo, art is a waje, a year my creation, and as ordinary sat to my creation. If you bark one, a war is legal, and it was a coup. To say, if you near two, waje bark one, as I'm swaggy bark one, a war is legal, and at his ordinance, I also saw the same look as idea. Call to sell or tongue if you know, see no beating me, a dear to your air, my cuisian, and hoka, a ma or matches or monday, air, my cuisian, Edo Mocano, or Timmy, a tutor, Sakanina, Edia Mom, which is a dear, I was some artist, Atto, air, my cuisian, say, and paying for emblem, I'm a buono, a matches and hocano, yan tutor, dear, a better yan, say, a your football legend, but I could pay your own, oh, a or my way, a better answer, I could brook. I ain't for the work. I was a young corner to see him could tea, a in summer black rasta. Ankasa edigu eye media no so efa e my creation ono e na chiso de sa expose we e be to eye media no so efa my creation we onko ne ku ti black rasta it says court order sale of michael etienne's two houses in accra court orders the sale of michael etienne's two houses in accra and i read michael etienne's two homes in east legon and trasaco are set for auction according to a report by daily guide now, the deputy sheriff of the high court, that's the commercial division, issued the order for the sale on June 12, 2024. Now, the properties in question are located at Stephen Kwashi Crescent, East Legon, house number 9, and Trasaco Phase 2, at Dringaron, house number 204 and 205, both situated in Accra. Asian football career began in, a, in, in France at Batsia. Later moving to Olympic Lyonnais before gaining fame at Chelsea, where he became one of the highest paid players in the Premier League. His time at Chelsea was marked by numerous successes, including Premier League titles and a UEFA Championship League trophy. He subsequently played for prestigious clubs like Real Madrid and AC Milan, earning global recognition for his midfield prowess. Despite his lucrative football career, Etienne has faced challenges in his businesses and investment ventures after retiring from professional football. Now, the financial pressures have uh, become apparent, leading to the sale of his properties. Now, this development underscores the uh, financial difficulties that many Ghanaian and African footballers encounter in managing their finances after retiring. From the sport. It's not a happy story. Followers of football know that this is not 
a sweet story. Now Michael Essien is going to have two of his houses situated conspicuously in two very, very opulent areas in Accra. Trasaco, phase two, and East Legon. Anybody who lives in Ghana and knows about Ghana knows that these are places that are huge when it comes to hope, opulence and prestige. Now, my brother, my sister, not in the far distant past, SCN was in the news for all the wrong things. What was it? One, his father had complained to the media that his son was not taking care of him, though he was rich. He also said he was so sick at the time. He was suffering from a foot or was it a leg that had been amputated or was near amputation. And he even gave access, unfettered asset, my brother, my sister, access to newsmen to even videotape and take photos of his lavatory. Those who don't know what lavatory is, toilet. At the time, he was using KVIP, a.k.a. Shitum. And he felt that by putting that in the media, that would put pressure on his son to do the needful. Well, Asian had it, and he came to the rescue of his father, who died only a couple of years later. But at least, it was a happy ending for the father and son. Now, Asian's reason was very simple. What was the reason? He said that his father did not take care of him, he abandoned him, and so on and so forth. And for that matter, he didn't feel any fatherly or sonly role towards each other. Many will say two wrongs don't make a right. And others will say, well, you sow what you reap. Depending where, from where you stand or coming from, my brother, my sister, it is what it is. Now, the second thing about ACN was about his personal relationships. At the time, he was dating Nadia Buare. Whatever happened, he was shoved aside and a new woman was picked up. I believe it is the new woman uh, after Nadia Buare that he is with right now. Of course, at the time, it was all good, rosy and nice, as you read from the story. So much money was there to spread. There was, you know, everything going on good for him. But all of a sudden, we are being told that he's going through hardships. He's going through turbulent term, times. My brother, my sister, is this true? Yes, it is true. The two houses are going to be sold. Why are the two houses going to be sold? Because the man is broke. And if the man is broke, why should the two houses be sold? Because he owes people. And if he owes people, and the people go to court. Of course. The court would say, all right, you have these properties here and there. They would have to be sold so that you'll be able to deal with these debts. How much is this man indebted? How big is the money? Now, it's a lesson for all of us. In fact, when you are active in life, you never get to know that. Or you never get to realize that a day will come when you will not be able to run the 100 meter race. A time will come when you will be weak. A time will come when you will unreservedly rely on your reserves. I'm sad for Michael Asian, a player of his caliber. He made so much money, more than a lot of his peers. From how he treated his father, he might not be that forgiving, but at the end of the day, pressure forced him to be forgiven. I don't know what to say. Are we learning lessons from this? Are we saving for the bad day ahead? Or we think it's going to be real rosy through that? Why I decided to pick up this story is simple. In recent times, we have seen entertainers who have reached out to the general public to save them from death. A lot of them ended up dying. We all remember 
without going too far away. KK Kabobo. He gave us all the entertainment we wanted. We all remember. Oh, Mark Jordan Amate. He also passed on just like that. Now, Iman Relama is also bedridden. And of course, it's also calling for help. At the same time, Akpache. We all remember Akpache. My brother, my sister, these were people who were with us in the days. They swam in some good life. They entertained us on the silver screens, including Abeku Grina. I'm talking about Jagapi. All these people right now are depending and relying on the benevolence of funds to be able to make life go around. My brother, if somebody like Asian would fall on bad days like this, think about that. Prince Tego recently had to be dragged to the court where he was forced to vomit some money that he took from people saying that he was going to give them cars or buy them cars. It never happened. He, he didn't have the money to pay back. He had to go back to court. And if you check how much money it was, it wasn't so big. But they are not able to afford that now. It means that we need to look at the creative industry better. And again, we need to take very, very good care of our investments if we do not want to go cap in hand in our days of want. I'm sad for ACN, but he has not called out to the general public for obvious reasons. He has always been a quiet man. I'm sure that times like this will remind him of his father. When his father was in need and was crying all over the place for help. When we also go through a little bit of this, we appreciate what it means to say we are hungry. I leave it here. Now the next thing I want to look at is coming from treenews.com and this is interesting. It says debate over Dutch passport and a Ghanaian PhD must serve as a reminder of the challenges facing Ghana. And this is Paul Boatin. Who knows Paul Boatin? Do you all remember Paul Boatin? A member of the House of Lords, the United Kingdom, Right Honorable Paul Boatin, has added his voice to the ongoing social media debate surrounding the benefit of a Dutch passport and a Ghanaian PhD. He says that this debate must serve as a reminder of the challenges facing Ghana. To him, it's a worry that some Ghanaians had the view that the passport was worth more than the PhD. I was going to say, 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 I was going to I was going to say, I was going to I was going to say, I was going to say, I was going to say, I was going to I was going to say, 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 Comment,